Hello, welcome to the Triathlon Down YouTube channel. Welcome to day one of the Ironman Decker super brutal double R training camp. Good morning, Liz. You okay? Yeah, brilliant, thank you. You started the day today with a, well, with a decent breakfast, which is good, and then you were on time for the ride. I know. You were ready, sun creamed up, ready to go. Yeah. Are you feeling all right? Yeah. I'm excited. Wicked. Well, wow. today's ride is we're going up Sabatella, then down Sacalobra, then up Sacalobra. No, we're not. We're going up for Menya. Down Sacalobra, up Sacalobra. No, we're not. We're going. Yeah, we are up for Menya. Oh, whatever. Basically, 65 miles or so, about six and a half thousand feet. So it's going to be a fairly long and hilly ride. Car back. Well, let's. But yeah, nothing too crazy. I don't, I don't know if James has got any intervals planned or not. We'll catch up with him, him in a minute. It's going to get hot, hot, hot. Morning James. Hey, morning. First proper day of the Decker <laughs> training camp. Yeah. What's on the agenda today? Uh, we're going for a bike ride this yeah. morning. Good. Then we're going for a run this afternoon. Perfect. So uh, it'll be good. Any intervals or anything on the bike today? Uh, no, I mean, we're going to Sacalobra, aren't we? Yeah. So you probably, you can never coast up there, can you? You've yeah. always got to have a little go, but uh -huh. it's a bit early in holiday for yeah. having a real go, I think. Yeah, and you come on the climbing bike today, so it's not the one you're going to use at the Decker, either of them. No, no, I ride this one on my holidays, yeah. yeah. It's my treat to so, myself. Yeah. So after this week, you then get in a bit more TTE bike specific focused. I'll probably right? um, only ride uh, the road bike with TTE bars for the short rides and then the yeah. time trial bike for long rides. Wicked. After the solid issue. Okay, all right. Bad enough fun. Yeah. <laughs> time to actually put some proper training in it. Yeah. I'll, well, now you're <laughs> here to see me ride. Exactly, you're right, yeah. Are you training for a decker this week? I'm basically am, yeah. Yeah, it only takes a week, you'll be fine. Apart from now, I swim yesterday, my shoulders are in bits this morning. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right, let's get up from then, yeah. Okay, Liz, we're about probably a quarter of the way up for menu. Your first Spanish climb, what do you think? I'm loving it. It's hot, isn't it? Boiling hot, but there's lots of shady patches, which is nice. Yeah. Just taking it easy, because that's hard work enough. Yeah, and Liz is still in the phase where she's like saying hello and morning to every single cyclist going the other way. You'll stop doing that soon, because there's 53 million of them. Okay. <laughs> so there's no danger of you getting an e-bike today then? No way. So for those that didn't see, I said to Liz that perhaps we should get one for her for the longer days or something. And she told me to do one. Her legs are going to get around, so yeah. come on, let's do it. They're going to do the work. We are, yeah. Oh, this is lovely. This is the climb that the um, Mallorca 70.3 Ironman comes up. I will not be doing that event. Stand up straight. Yeah. <laughs> nice. Nice. <laughs> really bad. So four port lose yeah. at Challenge Mogan. Massive, massive queue. Got to do your morning ablutions before race, and you? So queued up. And people were going in and out beforehand and like not saying anything. And then it got to my turn and I opened the door, right? And you know it's like plastic moulded with a hole in the middle. Mm -hmm. The mess was a good foot <laughs> above the top of the <laughs> hole, right? People must have been standing up and I thought, well, I'm absolutely desperate. I can't do it. So I had to stand on the side <laughs> to do the thing. And then I immediately, as soon as I went out there, I shut the door and said, no, you cannot go in there. It's, and told the staff to shut it. But people were going in and out, fed me as if it were normal. James just went, no. Oh. It, it just closed. I... All right, Liz, Sacalobra descent. Mm -hmm. Are we ready to rock and roll? Yeah. Hang on, let's just get away. Wayne, um... The last time I descended this climb with you, uh, <laughs> you, you, you right. didn't quite make it down in one piece. It was just I made it down. <laughs> yeah. Just with, didn't make it to the cafe. With a buckled front wheel. Uh, yeah. Wayne got very close and friendly with a hire car. Let's not do that today, please. 
No, okay. not, not the plan. All right, I'm gonna put this in my mouth now. Okay, Liz, Sakalobra descent done. What do you think? Oh, it's gonna take me hours to get back up there. <laughs> it's a big hill, isn't it? It sure is. It's beautiful though, look at that. Awesome. We've had a cafe stop at the bottom, so now we're just gonna trundle our way up to the top. Oh, I've got a bit of cafe legs. Without being sick, yeah, me too. <laughs> and a big chip baguette, so. <laughs> <laughs> Great decision. Uh, nothing crazy on the climb today, just gonna ride up. I don't know if I'm gonna ride with you or not, let's see how I feel. Okay, thank you. <laughs> I didn't mean like that. Get that viewing behind us. Oh, yeah. There we go. It's hot. It's like, I'd probably say it's nearly 30 degrees, yeah. isn't it? Loads of fluid on board, though, so keep slipping away. That was hard. If I remember to do so, I'll put the stats on screen, but I would estimate I did between 320 and 330 watts up there. Pretty hard all the way, if I'm honest. I felt like I had a bit left in the first half, but then it quickly got very, very hard. Heat hill whatever else so i've just gone to the top i've come back down a little bit to the bit where you go under the bridge just to see liz coming up because it'll make an awesome picture for one and for two as james has quite rightly pointed out brownie points <laughs> so uh, yeah hopefully she's having a good time i didn't ride with her so i didn't want to put her under pressure of me next to her and as you guys know me talking in your ear for ages isn't always the best thing so yeah hopefully she's not far off oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for coming I might have to put a uh, 18 warning on this YouTube video. <laughs> Not a problem. So we're in the only bit of shade on Sacalobra. It's been tough, hasn't it? Oh, it's so hard. I mean, it just goes on and on and on. Like, and it's quite steep as well. Yeah. So, yeah, I'm done in. Good. Well, let's finish it off and get down to those arches. Yeah. <laughs> Good work. <laughs> James, we had a good ride with Sakalobra. Yeah, we did, yeah. Pretty hard tempo, wasn't it? Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Just thinking, no, it wasn't hard tempo. It was for me. Yeah, it was okay, good. not too bad. You were breathing a bit heavy at the top, weren't you? <laughs> right. School assembly. <laughs> <laughs> it's not making the final cut. Um, <laughs> anyway, a few more miles to go. Let's go. I'm going to have to bleep that. It's a family channel. I can't... Oh, ride done and dusted. I think the stats on screen somewhere. Good ride, Wayne? Very good. Yeah, very nice. Thank you. Yep. Level the dream, aren't we? Elizabeth? Good ride? Yes. Sakalobra finished me off, but um, <laughs> completed it now, so that's it. I won't be doing it again. <laughs> it's a big old hill, isn't it? It sure is, yeah. I was fine until we did that, and then that's it. It was a tough finish after that. You finished it off, though. It's awesome yeah. work. Great ride. Liz is pretty broken, so... Five I'm a bit hours? better now. I'm a bit better yeah. now. I've had some time on the flat. Yeah. Good. Well, well done. <laughs> Unfortunately, for me, the day's not finished. James wants to go for a little run, so I'm going to get changed. Head out there. What are you two doing? All in each other beside the pool? Yeah. <laughs> Three pizzas each. Yeah. Brilliant. All right. Right, yeah, ready when you are. Oh, hang on, satellites. Can sit. So we literally cannot moan about having to go for a run after a bike ride because we're both doing things this year that are running for quite a while after riding for quite a while. So we've just got to get on with it, haven't we? Yeah, I don't bother me. <laughs> okay. It bothers me a little bit then. What's the plan then, James? Uh, so I'll just do uh, for a couple of hours, pretty yeah. steady, I think. Yeah. If it gets so that it's too much of a grill in, yeah. I, I'll, I'll cut it short, yeah. but I'll just see how it In feels. terms of prep, you've got back after you ride, you've had a shower, you said to get rid of some salt. Oh, no, well, get uh, cooler, yeah. uh, a Mars bar, yeah. a kind of pop, yeah. and I'm ready to go. I had a pano chocolate Perfect. and a poo stop, which is very handy for going for a run. Right, I'm ready when you are. Right. Let's go. I will uh, not be doing two hours. I will be over the moon if I can do 45 minutes to an hour. I've got to balance doing my own training, but then also supporting James. So running for 45 minutes to an hour with him might help him, it might not. Um, it is 37 degrees, two yeah. hours is a bit steep. Yeah. <laughs> um, but uh, yeah, I physically cannot run two hours. Uh, Coach Matt pointed out to me when he'd seen what I put in training peaks this week, that I've only ran three times for over an hour since March. So it doesn't make sense to try and run two hours after a five hour ride, but nice and steady there, man. Yo, yeah, I'll just make it nice. <laughs> so James, fueling wise, you're saying you're sick of carrying a belt now <laughs> after weeks and years of training with one, so you just... Well, it's crazy. I've got a running belt that carries a bottle of water and I must have used it for every long run for 10 years. But now I'm doing more than I would normally yeah. every day, every week. It just aggravates me. Yeah. So I've started to just make sure all my runs are short loops yeah. so I can have a drink. Yeah. At home, I run back to home yeah um, but things on the 
On the deck, are you not? I mean, you're not going to have a belt, are you? going to have no, yeah. bottles on the floor, so... <laughs> yeah, mugs following me around, yeah, aren't they? Exactly, yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, because I've just fueling while I've just got a bottle with some full steam carb mix in. The thing is, I've been on the bike all day, eating and drinking, so I'm probably pretty fueled. I had a pano chocolate frost it off just for something solid, but I can't face having like gels or chews or something. Having some carbs in fluid, it's easier just to get down, especially in the heat, isn't it? And we're not exaggerating, it is about 37 degrees, <laughs> so it's fairly, fairly warm. So I'm going through the fluids, but yeah, just keeping it sensible, aren't we? Yeah, pretty slow, isn't it? Oh, we're really like nine, nine and a half minute mile yeah. like But it feels fast enough. <laughs> See you, James. Okay, so that's the run with James done and dusted. I'll put my stats on screen now, but should be just over an hour. Nice and steady, and I'm feeling good. But I just know that I'm not used to running this long, and definitely not running this long after a decent bike ride. So just playing it sensible. I've drank all my fluid as well, so like if I was to tag another lap on now, I'd potentially be running out of fluid and so on. So yeah, let's um, get back. I think I'm going to have a little splash in the pool. I'll just cool myself down a bit. That's what Liz is doing as well. James, key part of any uh, DECA training week, <laughs> ice cream selection, what's your thought process, what's the strategy? Well, I just like to mix it up, I just like to mix it up. You can't beat cherry and chocolate together, Right. but I have that quite a lot, so I like to just mix it up a bit. I mean, Kinder Bueno makes all other ice cream obsolete, um, but who knows? What about you? Some sort of stupid vegan thing. <laughs> I brought a plum from the hotel. <laughs> <laughs> plum for a plum. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Wayne, what's the thoughts? Uh, I think I'm going for a, a scoop of cheesecake tonight. A scoop? Just one? Just one scoop tonight. I'm saving myself a, a double scoop after 100 miles tomorrow. Got it, fine. Kate, what's your, what's your ice cream of choice? Well, I'm debating whether to have two oh, scoops or not. Oh, I it's think you can be up to. Liz, what did, uh, what did you go for? Caramel this evening. Mm. Have a look at my lips. Well done for just wiping your hand on your face, that's lovely. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's normally my nose. So. I know it is, yeah. <laughs> okay, yeah, so we're just having a walk out after tea just down the seafront, get some ice creams. And walking a chat on the sea from absolutely love it. End of the day, can't wait to get stuck into this delicious plum. Jokes aside, like there's some uh, sorbet and stuff, but it's not really my thing, and I do need to drop some weight, so this is probably the right choice. Anyway, Decker training day one done and dusted. I'm feeling a little careful, honest. I finished that run thinking I could have done a bit, could have done a bit more, but in reality, that's probably how I should be finishing the first day of a training week, shouldn't I? So. Uh, yeah, um, I hope you enjoyed that. Let me know down below if you did. Click subscribe if you haven't already, and we will see you tomorrow at 1 pm for day two. It's going to be a longer ride tomorrow and then followed by a swim, hopefully. So, yeah, see you there. This is classic Instagram versus reality. Remember how he had that plum? <laughs> <laughs> That's not a plum. <laughs>